Welcome to another video. This is the first linear algebra proof video I am posting and I think I'm going to do that more often. Okay, so if you have any linear algebra proofs that you would like me to make a video on, just send me an email. You see the email at the beginning of this video. Every video that I post has my email. So just send me an email. Uh, don't type questions in the comment section. It's difficult to make what you're trying to tell me. So an email will be good. And a picture of the problem actually even helps better. So let's look at this question. We want to prove that the determinant of A transpose times A is equal to the determinant of A times A transpose. We know that when you switch the positions of matrices in the multiplication, the answers will be different. But this says that if A is transposed and you multiply A transposed by A, you get the same determinant if you take it than if you switch A and A transpose. We just want to prove that. And I want you to know something about proofs, that it is based on what you already know. You're not solving an equation. You're not trying to integrate or differentiate. It's just use what you know to show that this is true. A proof is that the statement is true. You just want to use some basic facts to show that it is true. So let's get into this. So there's a simple fact that we know. There are two things actually. The first thing is that when you take the determinant of any matrix, the answer you get is a number, right? Generally, it's a real number that you get. And there's a property of real numbers. You can switch the position when you're multiplying and it is commutative. So it means you can still get the same answer. Two times five is the same thing as five times two. And that's all you need to do here. It doesn't take long to answer. So what do we do? We're gonna say that, let's do it here. Actually, I'm going to do it here. Just say that the determinant of A transpose times A, we know that the determinant of a product of matrices is the product of the determinants. It's equal to determinant of A transpose multiplied by the determinant of A. This is one of the basic things you'll learn as soon as you do determinant, and I explained that in one of the properties of determinants in a previous video. Okay, go find it. Now, this is gonna be the same thing. This is a real number. This is a real number, they're numbers. And we know that the property of real numbers is that multiplication is commutative. So I can actually switch this to become the determinant of A multiplied by the determinant of A transpose right? But you have to justify this. What is the reason? It is a commutative property of multiplication in R for real numbers, okay? Just say multiplication. Multiplication is commutative for real numbers. That is the justification, and that's all you need to say. You need to show, or say. <laughs> I said say. <laughs> say and show is say. Okay, so once you have shown this, go back and remerge them. The determinant of A times the determinant of A transpose is the same thing as the determinant of A times A transpose. You're done with the proof. There's nothing else for you to say. Never stop learning. Those who stop learning have stopped living. Bye-bye.